wrapped up in my sleeping bag, looking out the window at Aaron's house as the sun is beginning to creep over the horizon. And the trees are silhouetted black against the emerging blue sky with the fading stars up in the sky. And I think to myself how much I hate Aaron because he's got it fucking made with this fantastic house of his, this nice little piece of property tucked away out in the backwoods of South Dakota. God, I fucking hate him. I hope he dies. I hope he dies of syphilis. You piece of shit. I am rarely optimistic. I got a laptop. You guys are over there. The laptop is here. My desktop is behind the laptop. And the reason I unplugged the desktop, plugged it in the laptop, because the laptop is Linux. And do you know how much fuckery I had to deal with to get my externals to jive with Linux? None at all. There was not even a notification like, you got to update your drivers. It just worked. Linux really is the hot, thin, obedient, charming, wonderful, loving wife who will make you cookies and not ask you stupid questions. It really is. Like, of all the shit I had to do today, this was the one I was like, oh, IT, here we go. Uh, uh, uh. And it was like going up to your woman saying, woman, what would you like to eat today? And she says, I want to go to a Mexican restaurant, that one over there at 6 p.m. Like, oh, my God, it worked. Holy shit. What I, oh, my God. And I'm pretty sure this is working. The audio's coming in good. The video is there, of course. Uh, <clears throat> this is not normally how I do it. This you get to see more of the the back office here. But so far, so far, this is the least amount of fuckery I've had to deal with in a long time. It is. This is what I said about Linux beforehand. I had to create a bootable thumb drive. This way, you watch my video on it. It's called Normal People Should Use Linux. This took me about two hours to install, to create this and install it on three different computers. I've already saved. It, it, how, how long would it take to troubleshoot Microsoft? Really? Like, remember, you get a Windows 11, brand new Microsoft machine, brand new Microsoft computer. How long would it take? Set it? No, don't do that. No, stop recording it. No, no, I don't want security. Say, oh, <clears throat> the update managers. Oh, God. Thank you. I spoke too soon. There was a pop-up. But I plugged it in and it just worked. I was expecting two hours of dicking around, Google searching everything, and here we are, Linux. It worked the first time. Like it's supposed... Do you remember the Atari 2600 kids? you remember Nintendo? You put it in and you played? That's Linux. The past is now. <clears throat> All right. I have to go get food. Let me see. Peek back error. Wait, what now? Wait, our, our main guy. Linux. Woo, wait, we had. Mike is too loud. <laughs> There's our technical solution. Uh, Mike is too loud. Boomer Mike coming in hot. Mike sounds like you have a Dixie cup or a bit rough. Okay, all right. Audio is too loud. Well, then <clears throat> maybe I'll have to go into the settings. Live chat exists. Yeah, I know. I know live chat. Five minutes. Audio is weird. It's on the wrong mic. Let's take a look. Match layouts. Go to the microphone.
All right, so I have to do the blue microphone. I got to take a picture of that. Blue microphones, analog stereo. <clears throat> I will do. Thank you guys for helping me with this. Thank you very much. <laughs> Fuck you, Mung Tilly. <laughs> Oh. Moving the mic away fixer from being too loud, though. Nope, not now. Atham is gay. Yes, yes, Filipino. He is. We're back. All right. So maybe I just got to push this away. I will adjust the sound settings. Look at that. Linux. The thinner, hotter wife that you never knew you could have. Look at that. All right. I'll see you guys later. Toodles.